It is uh, day 52, and uh, nothing really happened today. It was just kind of a boring day, and we kind of just, it's weekdays. Everyone's kind of just going back to doing their normal things, so we didn't really do much today. But we are planning something for tomorrow, and that is that we're going to the uh, Maison Centrale, Hanoi Hilton, also known as the Hualo Prison. Here's a uh, future Frankie for uh, historical context. Hualo Prison, or Maison Centrale, was built by the French in 1896. It was mainly used to store political opponents and revolutionaries. But the prisoners kept rolling in even after the French left Vietnam because the North Vietnamese continued to use the prison to store American POWs during the Vietnam War. The prison would mainly be destroyed during the 1990s with the front entrance becoming a museum. And I'm going there. Well, we're here. Water, food, rice. <laughs> so this was cell E. A cell that basically held all of the male political prisoners. And there had to be a lot of regulations made in order to uh, make sure no Vietnamese communists could uh, lead an organization here in the prison. That place back there was Catch Out, aka Dungeon, and uh, it basically was the place where in May two broke regulations were sent to go. So during the fight for independence for Vietnam, many uh, female communists were sent to prison. And this was where they ended up. This detention center. So these were the prison cells for those who were going on a death row, and uh, yeah, they're 
basically isolated from the rest of the prison just so just to mess them up a bit all right now that we've gotten with all of the french colonialism now let's get to the other part the united states All right, it's time to go. It was, it was an interesting place, but yeah, it's time to go. And it's also raining and it's gonna close soon. So yeah. So what do I think of the Hanoi Hilton? I think it's very dark with a very interesting history. I did find it kind of funny how the, the museum tried to portray it as that the Vietnamese were treating the Americans nicely. And I really recommend the, everyone who's like interested in like the Vietnam War to go. So yeah, that's it for me. Thanks for watching. Bye.